Uh, Coach, much has been made about uh, Steph's, you know, foul trouble throughout the series, and you know he got those quick uh, four early. Can you talk about how he was able to balance that with that that incredible second half? Well, that's what Steph does. I mean, I I, I actually told his mom and dad after the game. I said if that game didn't uh, personify Steph Curry, I don't know what did. I mean, he's uh, he's a guy who um, can make some plays that leave you scratching your head. You know, the fouls, uh, some of the turnovers, uh, not not tonight, but uh, sometimes he just makes plays and you, you kind of look look around th thinking, you know, what what is he doing? Um, but most of the time he he makes these incredible plays and he's just fearless. Uh, and that's what makes him who he is. So you, 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 um, you know, he reminds me a little bit of Manu Ginobili. Um, not so much in the style of play, but in the kind of swashbuckling nature, you know. Um, Manu used to drive pop nuts. Uh, my last year with the Spurs was Manu's rookie year, and, you know, pop would be pulling his hair out. And um, that's, that's how I felt when I started coaching Steph. You know, you, he makes these plays that, you know, nobody could have taught him this stuff. You wonder what he's thinking, and then you sort of realize after a while, leave him alone. He's so good that he's going to counteract, you know, the – the few crazy plays he makes with uh, an amazing number of good ones and clutch ones. He's, uh, he's an incredible uh, basketball player, a, a wonderful leader for our team, and um, just made some uh, amazing plays down the stretch.